Major Key Alert. Oh, we good now. Oh, we good now. Major Bag Alert. DJ Khaled. I got the keys, keys, keys. I got the keys, keys, keys. I got the keys, keys, keys. I got the keys, keys. Gonna learn how to do incline dumbbell bench press. So there's a few different ways of doing this. The way I personally like to do this for injury prevention is still to have my elbows tucked in as opposed to if I have my elbows flared out more of like a perfect 90 degree angle and I'm pressing up, it's great for the upper chest. So I'm gonna get a great upper chest workout for pushing straight since I'm on the incline. For safety precautions though, I still like to have my elbows tucked here and I'm pressing up and I'm still meeting in the middle. So I'm still getting my upper chest by doing it here, as opposed to coming out here and pressing here. Yeah, I might get better contraction if I'm at a 90 degree angle, but when I'm going a little bit heavier, I don't want to risk that injury. The risk to reward ratio is not good for me. So let me do a set with these and show you exactly what I mean. So I'll do one or two repetitions uh, where I'm 90 degrees, and I'll do the, the rest of them my elbows tucked in. So here's that 90 degrees. Alright, now this is me tucked. So you can see my upper chest is still activated. Uh, could you come around? All the way behind me. As you can see my upper chest still activated. Bring them back down to my lap. So that's going to save a lot of shoulder injuries in the future. Major key alert!